Cane Foods will donate $5 to Food Banks Canada for every good news story shared using hashtag McCain Share Good on Twitter and through their Facebook page. I love this initiative. So to share with our audience, McCain have sent down Wong Wing entrees and Super Fries. We'll be drawing for this $500 McCain prize pack after the show. Love when companies can share some good. We're going to share some good right now, actually, with Eric. So you're going to answer another uh, audience question. This is Linda. Linda, what would you like to ask Eric about? Hi. Well, I have this uh, fireplace in my family room. It's made of the same red brick as the outside of my 70s house. So the fireplace looks pretty 70s, and I would like to update it. What can I do? Mm -hmm. So the good thing is, is it's wood burning, and okay. it's just very basic. And because it's brick, it's non-combustible materials. So so long as we add non-combustible materials to it, you can basically do whatever you want. So I'm going to do a combination of leaving some things and cladding <coughs> others. I think that if you left the brick hearth at the bottom and put a steel plate at the bottom of that. So when I'm saying steel, it really is like the piping. Mm -hmm. So black steel, very industrial. Yeah. You wax it or you can clear coat it. Because it's a fireplace, I would wax it myself. And you just get a welder, a local welder, to bend it. They have to come and measure it and then they'll bend it around. So I've done the whole bottom in the steel. Then I think you need to beef up your mantle. And I do barn board or something kind of natural, mm. uh, get a little texture in your house. And then if you went to a really modern, uh, dark, split face stone. So you can buy them in, like they're 18 inches long by six inches wide, and they're all little pieces of stone all put together. Yeah. They kind of look rocky. You often see them in restaurants, and mm -hmm. they're available almost everywhere now. I think that Home Depot might even have them. Um, and I, I'd go dark because she's got quite colorful walls so I think you want the fireplace to just kind of be calm and modern. Nice you're really good with the the contrasting the dark colors there like do you usually lean towards going dark and light or is it dark and darker? Well every, What's your spa thing? every space needs black Yes. That's like a given. That's your thing. Even and, like and a so little two-year-old bedroom. Yes, yes. You have to have a black <laughs> Even a little nursery for a new yes. little baby. Yes. Get a little black, black bauble in there what? somewhere. Get some black marble in there. <laughs> that's interesting. That's, yeah. that's kind of like a design philosophy. And uh, we use steel a lot for that dark. Okay. Because it's natural, but it gives you that real grounding element. Yeah. And it does tend to be modern, but it also makes things disappear. So sometimes mm -hmm. when you're trying to accent a piece that's not really what you want, the yeah. steel kind of gives it an it edge. It anchors it. And uh, it's kind of, you know, back to that industrial feel. Yeah, see, I've peeled another layer on, <laughs> on the personality that is Eric. <laughs> I love it.